we get pulled over by police officers, it can be a pretty anxious moment, and doing something stupid suddenly becomes so possible. But just relax and focus and follow these basic steps as to what a policeman would ideally like you to do. The first step, obviously, is we're going to pull to the right and stop, making a point to get out of the flow of traffic. Remember, if you get out of the flow of the traffic, you probably are putting the policeman in a much safer position when he goes to step out of his car. Okay, next, put your car in park, set the parking brake, and I recommend rolling down the window. Okay, now you can turn the car off, and I recommend setting your hands here on the ledge of the window. Now, the officer is going to come by and he's going to ask for your license and registration. Obviously, I have it set up here because we're teaching. But they're basically asking for something like this, my license, a registration statement, which is going to be like this. Now, this is a little bit vague and really not necessary because the registration sticker that's on your windshield should match the information on your driver's license, and so that will usually suit the officer's requirement for registration. And then finally, the last thing we're going to have is an insurance card. And the officer's going to want to see all of those documents in order to fulfill his requirements in his stop so he can verify that the right person is driving this vehicle. In other words, by having these documents, you really help slow down car theft 